we're going to learn how to import a bitmap image. And this is going to work for all three versions of Toon Boom Harmony. So the first thing we're going to do is open up uh, our import images window. And we can do that uh, one of a few ways. You can go to File, Import Images. Or you can click on this little icon right here, which is the Import Images icon. And it'll bring up this window. Uh, in the Browse button, we're going to hit that. And in the folder you downloaded with your tutorials, there should be two bitmap images, Mountain Bush and Mountaintop Layout. And uh, Toon Boom can actually import several kinds of uh, image files, including PNGs, Photoshop files, JPEGs, and TIF files. And we're going to go ahead and open that. In the Layers options, we're going to, uh, you can actually have a couple options here. You can add to an existing layer, or you can create layers based on either their file names or create a single layer with all the, your imported images on one drawing layer. And we're going to go ahead actually and do create layers based on file names because that will mean that each image has its own layer. We're also going to vectorize the image and color that vectorization. The reason we're vectorizing it today, normally you wouldn't want to do that, but in this case we're doing it because uh, we're using a transparent PNG. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And we have our mountaintop layout and our bush. And I'm going to go ahead actually and bring the bush image up so that it's on top of the, lay the layout. That way the bush is in front of the background, like so. I'm also going to relocate these on the screen. I'm going to select all of the mountaintop layout image. You can see it's in pieces. That's because we vectorized it. When you, vect when you bring it in without vectorizing, it'll actually come in as one solid piece, which is usually preferable. So we're going to actually move it over so it's flush with the bounding box, which is our the view, which is our basically the, um, the s dimensions of our scene. And I'm going to do the same thing for the bush. I'm going to select all of it and move it over so that it's flush with the edge of the layout on the left side. And that is how you import bitmaps.